Hello, everyone, and welcome to episode one of what um, might be, I don't know, we'll see if I uh, start improving in Spelunky, uh, what might be a long series of uh, Spelunky 2, episode one. Um, we'll see how it goes. I played some of Spelunky 1. Let me turn off. Uh, I played some of Spelunky 1, and I've gotten started on Spelunky 2. Um, I'm playing on controller. Walk. There we go. Right stick for movement? No thanks. Okay. Um, <clears throat> excuse me. So yeah, um... Played some of Spelunky 1. I was never very good at it. Um, so those skills, those not good skills will transfer here. I will say I've never quite made it off the dwelling uh, before. So we'll see how it goes. I do, I watch a good amount of Spelunky gameplay. Um, I think that might be why I'm so bad at the game, because I try to play at the speed of people who are much better than me. But I think these things come with time. So we're going to play it until I either get tired of playing this game as a, a, a you know, in the series, uh, and, or, you know, I don't know, until people are like, hey, you should not play this game, you're wasting your time, which should probably come quickly. Uh, all right, well, without further ado, let's get into it. <clears throat> My main thing, right, I'll start off pretty cautious, and, um, Missed. I'll start off nice and cautious and slow, like I should. Dang it. Sorry. Sorry, Monty. Um, I did it twice. Scumbag. Um, hit Monty once. Shame on me. Hit Monty twice. What the hell are you doing? Stop hitting the dog. So, yeah. Um,. I'd like to improve, um, but yeah, I, I've, I've played Splunky 1, which is supposedly easier than this. Uh, I mean, probably, most likely easier than this. Hope there's no spikes down there. That's what I'm talking about. I try to move fast. Uh, we want the ghost pod, obviously. And uh, I make bad decisions. We're gonna take it with us here. We're gonna go get Monty, we drop down. He's fine. Oops, okay, we gotta go. Sorry, Monty. doing something really dumb. I'm gonna die. Take that. <clears throat> we'll do we'll get a quick dumb death out of the way. <laughs> I didn't like where we were HP wise anyway. So we're gonna try that again. Slow it down. And get it right. We use a bomb there because um I, like a dummy, um, did not really, well, I forgot. So basically, in that kind of situation, you can't really uh, jump up from the ground onto those platforms because you'll just land on the spikes and die, most likely. It's too dangerous, so just use a bomb or a rope to get out of it. I probably should have used a rope rather than a bomb, but I mean, what are they there for if not to use? How this game gets you, man. I thought I said slow it down. What's the rush? Like three minutes until the ghost gets here? I don't need to... That's another thing I need to get uh, out of my head. I don't have to kill every enemy. Um, other games have conditioned me that I need to take out whatever's in my way. This is uh, not like that. In fact, it's kind of dumb to kill every enemy, because you're... The more enemies you try and kill, the more danger you put yourself in, especially as a new player, so... Really get used to the idea of not challenging everything. I'm using a lot of ropes. That's fine. Pretty sure that, um... That feller there, uh, got impaled on some spikes. 
was good for us, bad for him. I don't remember, because I, I, I'm sure I looked at it and was like, I'll come back for it, but did we already find the ghost pot? This is bad. Nope, get out of there. <laughs> Woo! He didn't kill himself on spikes. Doesn't look like there's anything... Well, I don't know. I can't really say that, but... I'm gonna go ahead and run on the assumption that there's nothing good over there, because I don't want to use resources to get over there. There's the ghost pot. I was wrong. It was another run we saw the ghost pot on. <clears throat> need a rope to get over here. I don't think it's worth using two ropes, because I need a rope to get out of here as well. I guess I could have bombed also. I do have four bombs, but like I said, bombs are more valuable to me than ropes. <clears throat> yeah, I made it to the second floor. That doesn't happen every run. Ah, ah take that. <clears throat> Excuse me, I do have hiccups. I just ate uh, some yummo Chinese food. Nope. Do some sacrificing. Sorry, Monty. But glasses are okay. Going a little shopping spree. Is nice. No. Can I, I don't know if I can actually make that jump. No, I can't. Okay. Yep, I did buy a bunch of ropes. I think I'm gonna go, actually. Yeah, okay. Here's the play. Ready? We rope up. Go to the store. Sell him the idol so I don't need to carry it. Go buy him, go buy him, go buy money. No, no, go pick up the other money. Grab more money. And then grab some more money. Something, there's a case to be made. There's a case, sorry. Uh, <laughs> I had to focus for a second. Um, there's a case to be made for bringing this bad boy up. To sacrifice to Kali. She seems happy. Those spots here. Don't like that. So here's the thing. And this is true with Isaac as well, when I played Isaac a bunch. Um, my tendency to try to run like high level strats pretty much is like always, always a disastrous results. Like for example, Sacrificing Monty to Kali has cost me an HP, which I probably could have used. Same thing with the turkeys. I could have bombed them and got some HP, and I didn't. But, you know, I think it's good to, to establish good habits. Like, um, trying to get the Kapala when you can. Even if you're still a beginner, you know? Right? Makes sense? Does to me. Come on, Montague. And for you to... to go. No! He perished, but it's fine. I did get the Kapala for the first time in uh, Blinky 2, which is a. Uh... which is nice. Hmm. 
so we're on the lookout for first floor where they're on the lookout for Monty, at least. I don't need to go that way. I was like gonna go and trigger that arrow trap and again. Spelunky is very much a game of picking your battles. And uh, there's absolutely no reason for me to go disarm that arrow, arrow trap. It's just my brain is like, ooh, arrow trap, make sure it's fired. Which is silly. It's absurd. Womp, womp, womp. All, in, all around, I would say, pretty successful first floor. I would like to have gotten more money, um, but I didn't take damage, which is... Honestly, the best I can ask for. I will take these spike shoes. Come along, Monty. That. No, not you, Monty. I'm sorry. Could be big. Ooh. Double booted. For sure. I'm gonna. Oh, that was stupid. Okay. I wasn't sure if that was gonna clear our way down for us. I will take a rope because I wanna. I take him up, and there's another one down here. It's gonna, if not get us the Kapala, get us very close to the Kapala. Almost. This Torky might do it. Hopefully, dead Torky still counts. Boy. Oh, okay. Well, we are right there, so. Time we encounter Ali might be. Might be it. Um, did, I, did I already drop off the idol? Hmm. For turkeys, want to help? I have bad news for you, my friend. <laughs> mm -hmm. If I didn't have the spike shoes, I would grab that uh, roly lizard. But, uh, I do, so I won't. Always buy a bomb box. Unless you got, like, a million bombs, in which case... I don't know, do what the hell you want. You got a million bombs, what are you talking to me for? No! Fine. That was stupid of me, but it's fine. Should've just... I'm out of ropes. Who needs ropes? And you got ops. Oh, I need ropes. Got him. Do 
you kidding me? Alright, Mati. One day I'll learn how to jump. One day, but that day will not be today. Today is reserved for Kapala only. Now we're gonna kill the snake, but he needs to come out from under. Ooh, the spikes, give me the blood. All right, we're um off to the races now, I think. Wanted to double check and make sure there were no ropes in there. It's fine, I'm not too torn up about ropes. Like I said, we have the, got the boots. What I like, some ropes, for sure. I mean, but you know, I play with the the hand I've been given and uh, with the hand I you know supply myself. I guess what I could do. We really want to throw this run. That was the wrong way. I just had to get it out of my hand before I died. <laughs> okay, this is not working. Unless... I'm going to try one more. Bad. Greed, kids. <laughs> the learn from my mistakes. Monty is trapped. Free him. reason I followed up and actually finished killing that guy it was uh us I hate his stinking guts no um because I felt like I was gonna come back if I didn't kill him he would come back and uh, get me parachute is not really what I wanted to see but take it Go to hell, mole. I see you down there. That should have hit me. I really not lucky. Try to move fast. Sometimes you miss the arrow traps. That's just how Spelunky goes. The way of the Spelunker. Arrow traps come at you fast. <laughs> what the hell are you doing? Let's just leave. Let's go. I remember when I had that really promising run and then uh, really just kind of beefed it. I want to come back for that cape if I have enough money for it later on. Thank you, uh, Parachute. I hate to do it, but um, I want that key. Also gotta be super careful there, cause uh you, you you snake. It's fine, it's fine. I really like the sound that these boots make. I did not think it was gonna go that way. Absolutely devastating. Oh my god. Well, that's a 
episode one of Spelunky 2. And if that's any indicator of how the series is going to go, well, uh, you know, we'll see. I'm optimistic, though. You know, we had, um, I'll say moments, moments of brilliance in there. Like brilliance is a little, a little much. Maybe moments of promise promising yeah okay well we'll say we'll say moments of promise anyway thanks for watching uh if you liked it do click that link button it helps a great deal it'll, it'll get me uh you know on more people's pages and such same thing uh give me some comments let me know what i'm doing wrong what i'm doing right um i mean honestly mostly wrong but um yeah and uh you know subscribe if you want to see more this is a monday wednesday friday sunday series uh so yeah thank you and uh i'll see you next time